Hey what's up guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you don't know me, hi, I'm Tita and so for today's video we are going to turn my iPhone 11 into a very aesthetically pleasing device. I just want to say that I'm sorry this video is not a very well thought out video because I actually put a lot of effort into this one but since my university is taking up so much of my time this week I just wasn't able to film a proper long and uh, video so here's a very helpful and effective one <laughs> So if you don't know by now, I do own an iPhone 11 and I'm saying like this because I've done a bunch of videos on this iPhone and so if you want to know more about it, here are some... here? Or there? I never know. Here <laughs> are the videos related to this iPhone if you want to know more about it. But for this video, I'm going to be teaching you, giving you some tips and everything else on how to turn your smartphone into a very aesthetically pleasing device. By the end of the video, there will be a list of some extra content to just help you guys organize and turning your iPhone into a very aesthetically pleasing world. So this is how my phone looks like as if right now. So, as you can see, I have a lot of apps and they're organized into folders. Honestly, that's how I think or how I like to organize my phone because that makes me not using all the apps or going into my phone more often. And so, yeah, I like to keep everything organized. So, the first thing that I really want to do first before starting to do the whole aesthetic things is to declutter my phone because what is aesthetic without being organized right so that's the first thing that i'm gonna be doing i'm just going through all my apps on my iphone and see the ones that i really use or the ones that i'm planning on using soon and delete the ones that just don't make sense for me anymore or i was just not satisfied with how they work in general. So one of my obvious tips to turning your smartphone into a more aesthetically pleasing object is to change your background picture, your background image. And so for that, I highly recommend you to go on Pinterest and just search a simple background aesthetically pleasing or aesthetic background that really helps you to just keep on the mood and also to get more inspired and see what vibe do you want to give to your phone since now it's spring I want some flowers beach vibe just something very summery also and so for that I try to look for bright photos and very well edited ones I also have my Pinterest link down below if you want to go follow for more inspiration. I have boards on like aesthetic backgrounds as well, so yeah, that's basically what I did. I decided on two pictures because I thought it would make more sense to have one designated for the lock screen and the other one for the home page. The next tip that I have for you is whenever you're organizing the folders and naming them, I highly recommend you to just, whenever you name them, to space the letters because that just gives a whole aesthetic to the phone. It makes everything coming together and honestly makes a huge difference without you even like think about it. So the next tip that I have for you is to organize your apps on your home screen according to the color. So not like on the folders according to the color, but I like to organize on the home screen the ones that are not on folders just to be more aesthetically pleasing and with a more coherent flow, you know? <laughs> Another 
tip for you if you have an iPhone is to go onto the shortcut app I actually deleted so I had to go to the app store and get it again but this basically allows you to change the icon of any app that you have on your phone or of anything actually and so here's how you can do it I personally found it not very user-friendly but I think that's because I was just so used to the logos of each app that whenever I change it, I just got a little bit confused and so I forgot about that idea really quickly. But I highly recommend you if you want to just change the whole aesthetic of the logos to just go on Google, for example, or on Pinterest, for example. If you want to change the Pinterest logo, you go on Google or on Pinterest and search aesthetically Pinterest logo or something like that and you just decide on the logo that you think will fit better into your aesthetic download it and go onto the app and do this little thing To finish up this video also one thing that I really think makes a difference when you're looking at your phone is your case I have only these two cases for my iPhone and I actually love them because the pink is like one of my favorite colors very aesthetically pleasing very pastel and I love it and the other one is just a simple clear case that you can see me unboxing it in this video or yeah i really like this case because i can just basically put anything that i want in there like between my phone and the case and it will be shown and so i like to just play around with polaroids i've ordered more two cases and are these two and i really love them i'm just waiting for them to arrive so as i am editing this video i received the one of my cases and let's open this thing oh, it's the blue one dang ah! <clears throat> oh my god it has like a thank you card on it oh i'm so excited it's so beautiful It feels amazing honestly i'm in love with it i don't know how much was it i'm gonna leave it here and this is the store that i purchased from uh, you don't know how lovely you are thank you so cute like and this is the case so let's change say bye bye to the pink one now because I'm going to put oh my god ah! <laughs> Oh it looks so cute and tiny and like uh amazing so yeah thank you so much and like excellent service excellent like case it feels amazing very comfortable and the color is just the one that I wanted so yeah I'm very excited so yeah back to the video <laughs> to give it a thumbs up comment down below some tips that you recommend on following so we can achieve a better and much more organized device and yeah i'll see you on my next one it will be very special and um, that's why i didn't post this week because i need two weeks to kind of work with it you know so next week a very special video and i'm very happy how it's going to be um how it's turning out and it's a very like common topic on my channel so if you want to comment down below and guess it what video is gonna be do it and i might take advantage and take some ideas out for 
future videos <laughs> i don't know i'm sorry i'm just talking and talking but yeah i love you guys all so much and what the heck we are 7k in this channel and i'm so happy i almost cried no, i cried when i saw it so yeah uh <laughs> obviously i'm very happy for all um the nice and cool <laughs> community that is growing on this channel and i'm very blessed as well and so yeah thank you all so much and i might just end the video now right okay i'll see you in my next one bye